Good morning, beautiful people. It's Sherry Moulton back with another video. I hope everyone had a wonderful Christmas. It's nice. I love the Christmas. I love the holiday. It's just so much work for one day. But I love the get together of people and I love that aspect of it. So beautiful. I hope everybody's Christmas was well. It was been a different one this year. So I'm hoping everyone has gone through it fine. But we're gonna get back at it. Today's bling bling day and I have to show you what I made. You people can relate to this. Fueled by coffee and glitter. Does that explain? So that I made one apron and then I made this other apron. This one is like, I craft so hard I fart glitter. I had my Cricut machine out yesterday, so I had to make these two. I've been wanting to make them for a long time. I'm wearing two today. Um, so I uh, put them together, thought I'd show you guys. Um, yeah, so we're gonna do a bling bling painting. We're going back to basics. We're just doing your basic bling bling painting. Um, this one again is from my cousin's store. <laughs> so this one is gold and this beautiful pink. It's called champagne pink. And yeah, with that being said, I'm going to bring you down and we'll go through everything. All right, there we go, my beautiful people. Now, this canvas has been painted for a long time. I'm just going to take this board out from underneath. Um, so I'm not sure. I'm 100% sure this side is gold. <laughs> and it is this type of paint. It's not this can because this one is white. But it's this paint. Um, sorry, I got it at the dollar. I hate when they put um, stickers over the labels. I'm pretty sure it says color. Oh my goodness, Sherry. And the other one has the same thing, sticker on it. Anyways, it's all purpose enamel paint and it is gold. And the um, this one here is that universal pearl paint this one is um champagne pink so we are going to use our um liquid glass we're going to use liquid glass this one's white but i'm using clear um now you don't have to use the liquid glass you can use resin is what i normally use to use or you could also use the Mod, Mod Podge. This is the Mod Podge. So I will link the videos that show you with the Mod Podge and I'll link the video that shows you with the resin. And um, yeah, then you guys can use whatever, I'm gonna go this way because the board will be better. Um, you can use whatever you want to use, whichever is better for you. I am going to use Ashland's decorative filler. This one is going to be the gold, which is nice and chunky. I'm going to use, I bought this huge thing from um, Walmart. It is champagne glitter. And I don't really have a color. Like I've said before, I'm going to open it up so you can see it. Like I've said before, I'm not that much of a gold person. I'm more silver. So I don't have any really nice fine glitter. So I'm gonna have to go to Michael's and get some fine glitter. So I have these ones, they're both recollections. Um, this one is holographic gold and this one is gold. So I might use a little bit of both. I'm not too sure, you know how we go with the flow when we go. And another question I've been getting asked is, what do you do with all the glitter that you shake off? This is what I do. I have cups upon cups upon cups with the glitter ah, in it. And they are just um, stacked in my little container over there. And there's some more. This has got the teagle in it. This is the one that I used when I did the rainbow. So you don't have to waste it and um, just find something else that you're going to use it with. This one is the one that has the, the pearls with the copper pearls. 
So, yeah, I never get rid of it. I always, always throw it in a container and then you have to find um, something to do with it. So anyways, with that being said, we're just gonna get right at it. So I did spray paint these. I have a video that shows you how to spray paint and I will link that also in the description box. And yeah, we're gonna get right at it. I have, um, sorry, I'm just cleaning off the end of this. There we go. So my hats are done. I hope you guys, I might, I said to my husband, I might just do, let me know in the description box if you would like this, a video of just all the hat videos. No painting. It'll just be me wearing all of these silly hats. So let me know in the description box. Wipe that part off. Actually, I quite like using this liquid glass. I didn't think I would, but I like it because the fact that I come down here in two hours and it's more or less dry every time, which is kind of nice. All right, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna pull out a brush just because I might use it. I'm gonna use one of these. These are my um, makeup applicators. So I had mine. I'm going to open up this one. Somebody sent me this one. I'm going to open this one. Use it. There. It's pretty pink. All right. So we're just going to, I'm going to thicken it out a little bit. Make it that base wider. Come to the edge without going over. I got a soda stream for Christmas. <gasps> My hubby bought me a soda stream and that's quite cool because I love to drink. I'm not a real much of a pop drinker so I love drinking. I don't know if you get it in the States but here we have a, um, a flavored water called Bubbly and I drink it like there's no tomorrow. So this is a lot cheaper. So yeah, it works kind of cool. We're just going to drag it up and down just to make the wispies and if you find you need to add more you can add more you want to try and make sure they go straight and I'm gonna flip it so I can do the same this way see I find these don't push it out like that foam brush does. So. Yeah, it's weird. It's not sticking to the canvas almost. I'm going to actually just take the brush, my, my um, bottle, and I'm just going to do like I did with the trees, just make little If you can see what I'm doing there, just a gentle squeeze. We'll do the same this way. And kind of just make sure it's kind of even, which looks pretty good. I think that's that. I might do a little more here because there's not much there. Oh, and of course it doesn't want to come out of the... There we go. I may have to get a, a different bottle for my... Usually I had it in the little squirt bottle. Wipe the end off. There we go. 
Now here, the fun begins. We're gonna put our glass down first. I don't usually cut my hands, but you can put your gloves on. I'm, I don't mind uh, it's having, you go gently with it. I'm not like crushing it in my hands either. So I tend to go heavy in the middle. I'm excited. Um, I ordered some dried flowers online and apparently they're coming on Monday, which is tomorrow. So I was thinking that I might do the video of the light bulb with dried flowers in it and clear glittered resin. So I'm excited to try that because I think that one will work. I think that's good. I just, I just so love this chunky. I wish the silver came that chunky. All right, now let's get our glitter on here, my friends. As my, I've only had one cup of coffee because I really only got up and, and this is all I've had out of it. So I'm not quite there yet. <laughs> all right i'm not too sure about this container i might just open it up and sprinkle it out of my hand because the the lid on it isn't quite the best that is pretty though i think it goes quite nice with that all right up hot oh i guess i'm just shaking it out of the bottom of my hand <laughs> i guess it's the way it was sitting There, I think that's good. Oh my goodness. My daughter's adorable. She bought me, um, she always bought me lilac perfume. I had this infatuation with lilac perfume. I don't know if anybody in Canada will remember, but Yves Rocher used to get like flyers in the mail and then they opened up stores. I'm gonna put some of this chunky gold. And it ended up that uh, they discontinued the perfume I buy from there. And it literally, it smelled so much lilac, like real lilacs. And I have an issue um, that I, I uh, have, when I put perfume on, I can't really wear it most of the time. Yeah, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm just going to put it in my hand because I don't want a whole, a whole lot. But I want a little bit of the chunky. There we go. And I seriously, I do not have any fine gold. Unless I go into one of these. Oh, here we go. Break open the dollar stores. Yeah, I'll put one of these in there. So anyways, um, she <laughs> it, it was so, so funny. She bought me a Febreze um, wall plug-in that has two, two, two cents in it. And she wrote on it, this is the closest I could get. And it was lilac. So it was kind of cute. All right, all right, all right. I think I might actually go. Oh, it's this I'm trying to match. Oh my goodness, Sherry. I think I might go with this one. I went to Michael's to buy some, like I said, I have no actual fine glitter that is gold and they had nothing. It's like, seriously. So if you people know of any beautiful fine glitter I can order, let me know. I'm the type, I like to see it. So I don't tend to order the glitters online, but um, I'm game to try. All right, here we go. Up high and, and light. Oh, there we go. That That's what it needed.
just needed something to cover that uh, there we go I think that's good and I might come back with a little bit of this pinky again just to tone that down a little bit And again, like all this ain't going to stick. Well, actually I've learned with this, it's, I think just about everything sticks. I don't have much shake off with this when I'm doing it with the, um, the liquid glass, which is too cool. Well, there you go, my friends. I'm going to leave it sit. I'm going to drink the rest of this coffee and I'll come back in a few hours. And I'm so sorry it's late today. I'm making this actually on Sunday, so I will um, have it up for you as soon as I can get her out. I'll see you in a bit, guys. Hello, we are back. We're going to shake off. And you see what I mean? There's not much to shake off with this um, liquid glass. It's just amazing. Now I'll brush into the glitter, try to shake off what might be loose. I personally do not put anything on this. Feel free to coat it with a spray varnish or you can coat it with a whole coat of resin. It is what up to you, whatever you desire. Look at that, that is beautiful. So yeah, I personally like the contrast of this being more so matte. This is glitter and it's in your face. And when you sit there in, a, in your chair and it look, you look over, it sparkles because you're seeing this as where everything would be shiny. And, but that's just my personal preference. And so that's why the world is so wonderful because everyone is different. Look at that, I'm impressed. Well, there you go, Junie. There's another piece for your store. Well, there you go, my beautiful people. I hope you enjoyed the video, um, short and sweet. Um, I actually received my flowers in the mail today, so possibly this week I'm gonna do another one of those um, light bulbs, but I'm gonna put dried flowers in it. So I'm excited about that. And I'm gonna play with something, and I think you might be impressed. I think this one's kind of cool. So anyways, with that being said, I hope you all had a wonderful Sunday. Um, if you have not yet subscribed, please do. Give the video a thumbs up. Um, look for that wonderful bell somewhere in there and give it a little ding so you get notifications of my next video. And if you like what you see, please give it a share. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Love you guys. Have a wonderful day.